Hi there Year 9s, welcome to the third video on the unitary method. Take a moment to write classwork, the title and the date. In this video our objective is to, is very similar to video 2, is to find out how much several items cost if you know how much a group of items of the same thing cost. This time though the questions are not broken down for us. We are given no hints or part A, part B that will help us, it's just straight to the difficult part of the question. Typical question would be something like, I don't know, seven pencils cost £1.40, how much would five pencils cost? That type of thing. Okay, so let's do three examples, then I'll leave you do a few questions yourself. First one, eight CDs cost £32. How much would five CDs cost? So we're going to use our picture method. Okay, so let's draw a rectangle and... Um, that's going to represent 8 CDs which cost £32 in total. So let's split it up into 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Now what must go in each box? What must each CD be worth? Well, by trial and error you'll see there must be 4. Okay, because 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28 and 32. Okay, so therefore, you know, um, and we're going to first of all say that one CD must therefore be £4. So what would five CDs be worth? Five CDs, well, it'd be five lots of this. So 4, 8, 12, 16, 20. It would clearly be £20. And there you go. You've done a difficult question. Or you could have just, in this case, coloured them if you wanted. So it'd be 1, 2, 3, we want to colour five, like that. Okay, similar thing here. If six CDs cost £30, how much would 11 CDs cost? Well, let's draw a picture. There's our six CDs. Let's draw it a little bit smaller. There's our six CDs. Uh, they cost £30 in total. And we've got six of them, so one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, uh, sorry, just made a small mistake here. Four, five, six. There we go, six CDs. One, two, three, four, five, six. What goes in each box? Well, clearly five must, because five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty. So clearly we know that one CD is equal to five pounds, one box. How much would eleven cost? Well, if you wanted to, you could just keep drawing the pictures. So you've got one, two, three, four, five, six here. You could have a seventh one, an eighth one, a ninth one, a tenth one, and an eleventh one. And then count. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55. Therefore, 11 CDs must cost £55. Done. Okay, and the last example, three CDs cost £24. How much would eight cost? Let's draw ourselves a little picture. Here's our three CDs. In total, they're £24. Got three of them, one, two, three. What must go in each box? Well, £8. Because then we'd have eight, sixteen, twenty-four. And therefore, we know that one CD costs £8. Right? And the question then is, how much would eight CDs cost? Well, it'd be eight lots of eight pounds. And what you could do is you could draw another few boxes. So we've got one, two, one box, two box, three box, another box, four, five, six, seven, eight. And in total, that must be eight, 16, 24, 32, 40, 48, uh, 56, and 64. So clearly we would have 64 pounds there. And that would be our answer to that question. Done. Okay, so I've got a few questions for you to try yourself now. Um, and here they are. So those questions there, do try those five using the box method and try the harder two at the bottom as well, just to check you can do it with even harder examples. Okay, and that's it for this video. Thank you for watching.